<laughs> anything else. Yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody, somebody actually gave us a warm up. Woo! <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. Woo! Yeah, uh, J Cole dropped some music. He dropped two new bangers, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna spend some time on this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was ready. I yeah. was ready, but um, yeah, man. Yeah, go they, ahead with that. What you? Well, it's it's only two songs, so either you like them or you don't. But we, I like them, and, and you like them as well. Yeah. So the tracks, um, it's a EP collection. It's called Lewis Street. Mm -hmm. Um, the first one is the climb back, and the second one is Lion King on Ice. Now, these tracks are amazing. Yeah. They're amazing. I know you said you like one more than the other. I think I'm the same way, and I think you definitely talking about the climb back. You like yeah, the more climb than back the, was nice to me. Yeah, me too. Me too. I, I like the climb back more. I feel like the they're both great records, but I I, 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 like, I like the grit of the climb back. Yeah, I like the bass and the 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 what he's talking about. He's 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 really like he's really giving us a lot of substance with that record. It is it's it's amazing, but um, he's actually saying like when he actually comes out with this full project that he's gonna retire damn. how you feel about that mj got that, that that damn mj documentary got everybody <laughs> gonna retire. i Man. think logic was <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah um i feel like he's a i mean i don't know why he wants to retire but um if he wants to do that that's up to him yeah i personally think j cole is one of the guys that we could use in the rap game and benefit yeah, from we can't lose j cole man but to be honest looking back on it now like j cole he's not that um What's the word? I feel like J. Cole be in a whole nother world. Yeah. And I feel like... um He pop in and out of social media. Yeah. He don't really be... Like, yeah, I think J. Cole, like... I think the whole limelight isn't for him, which is probably why he wants to retire. But, like, you don't really hear him hop on a lot of features. J. Cole seems like he stays to himself. Yeah. So, um... I'm not surprised. I'm, I'm surprised a little bit because of how young he is in the game. Even though he's really an OG, when you think about it, like yeah, he's today, OG. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think his first. He been it's crazy though. He's like a young OG. Yeah, young, yeah, young OG. Yeah. It's got to. We got to say young OG. Yeah, shout because out to Fab, young OG. Yeah, he yeah, yeah. That, shit. that was a dope ass project. Yeah, so he is a young OG, but it'd be nice to still have him around when you got people like Jay Z's fifty something and he's still rapping. So I don't see why not. But um, yeah, I mean. These these two songs made me thoroughly appreciate how good he is and how dominant he is. And, same, same here, and, um, same here. You know, we 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 really lack this in the the musical game. So yeah, it hurt to see him go. Yeah, my take on it is, um, I'm a big fan of Cole. Yeah, my first my 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 favorite artist, of course, is Kendrick. Mm -hmm. I'm King Kendrick all day, but my second is a very close to Kendrick. Um, Cole, I grew up like. I grew up like that's when I really started, you know, really I oh. mean, I, I enjoyed the lyrics when I listened to like maybe um old Tupac and stuff like that, whatever, whatever. But I seen the growth from the very beginning of J. Cole from the first mixtapes, you know, like the um the warm up. The come up and all the come up and the warm up yeah. and the grown Simba and yeah, the Lights yeah. Please. Mm -hmm, yeah. And then when he first got the track on the Jay Z album, the um Oh, Rising? No, that was on his album, Rising. No, oh, for, it was a star. Oh, star, star is born. born. Yeah, yeah, star is born. Like, I've seen the come up of um J. Cole from the beginning, and I always, like, rock with J. Cole. So, for him to actually be in this 2020 state where he's going through the pressures of what happened with the with the last track he put out and from addressing the what the, what the no-name um, girl said about the rappers like having a whole catalog about the black plight and they not even saying nothing. Mm -hmm. Um for him, I felt like he should have never he shouldn't have even said nothing about that. I felt like, but I mean it, it's going back into maybe a conversation that we're gonna have later about maybe being a little sensitive. Mm -hmm. But um I feel like maybe he should have never addressed that or maybe it hit him too hard where it's it's affecting his music right now you can hear it you can hear it so you can hear it. I, i'm pretty sure i'm pretty sure before that rec before that record came the last record came he wasn't thinking about maybe retiring i, I just i don't feel it oh you, you you think the backlash from social media has something to do with him wanting to retire now you yeah i feel like he's like man like could, could he's he's questioning a lot of things like like for instance like he said in that last record he said um the beginning of the track he said um um, dude said, um, hey Cole, I love what you're doing, this, this, and that. Yeah. And um, he said, um, he said, appreciate it, but back in my but the back in my head, I was like, I ain't really doing shit. And I felt like a hypocrite. And he was saying, you know, I'm not that equipped. And so, talking about social issues, which 
I know we can relate to, but um, yeah, he's like questioning. Like people were trying to actually cancel. Him. I seen people on Twitter. I seen people on Facebook. Yeah. They was actually saying like, oh, I don't like what J Cole said. He ain't say nothing. This, this, and that. And then going forward with these two new songs. I'm not even hearing. It's like people not even trying to listen to these songs right now. Off, off of the last song. It goes back to that Nick Cannon thing. Like one thing I do notice when um, let me see when when people that we look up to when we shun them like this or in this way. Like I remember it happened with a lot of people. I remember when Bob Marley got shot in Jamaica. He he exiled himself to the, you know to yeah. Europe. Uh, what happened in it? Not let me. I don't even know why I'm putting Nick Cannon in the same breath. But yeah. when people get wronged by their own people you know they tend to you know feel some sort of way and you know which is why nick cannon said like yo like i I put my ass on the line for y'all yeah and you know i tried to apologize to them because i didn't mean what i said yeah in a harmful way he probably he, he probably means what he says but to see your people turn against you like that it makes you just be like you know what to hell with all y'all. And yeah. maybe J. Cole might feel, you know, he might feel some of that same way when it comes to this situation. It's like, yo, like I'm trying to tell y'all to listen to this girl or someone more equipped for the social issues that the social issues that are going on. Y'all are telling me, oh, I'm a sellout, I'm this, I'm that. I'm trying to put out good music for y'all. Y'all don't care about me. So yeah, you got a point. But it's probably It's a weird time, man. It's a weird time. Like we losing, like we got J. Cole questioning his catalog. Like and then, and then, mind you, I mean, my favorite Kendrick, he ain't saying shit. Like he ain't yeah. saying shit. I know he cooking up, yeah. but we ain't hearing a word. We ain't hearing a word from him. So, if I mean, I know we gonna get some great. I know we gonna get a great project because Damn was an amazing project. But if we don't get, you know, a, a, something like that from him, who knows? Yeah. I, I know Kendrick. I know Kendrick is not as. Um, Sensitive is maybe J. Cole, so he might not, if he was to get that type of backlash, he probably wouldn't care. But if he's not, like, addressing it at, at like, at this point, it's, like, he might be in the same same boat. Like, like somebody told me last night, I forgot who I was talking to. Yeah, I was talking about, oh, Jafari. Shouts out to Jafari. Shout he was telling me, um, he was like, oh, we tra- they traded in um, Kendrick for D-Smoke. I was like, what? <laughs> nah. Nah, shouts out to D Smoke, but nah, we still rocking with Kendrick. We definitely still rocking with Kendrick. I don't even know who D Smoke. Who's D Smoke? Oh, sorry, sorry about that. Oh, you. Know, oh. Is, who, who's? Who I'll send him some links later, ladies and gentlemen. Who's D Smoke? We'll, we'll touch D, on the next episode. On episode six. Who's who is he? Who's he? I don't. He's know. a rapper. He's, a, he's he, he was on um the Netflix special. Remember the 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 the. I'll really be watching that. He's dope. He's dope. He's got a song with um. He's got a video with it, with what? Issa Rae and um. He's got some dope songs, but he's um. He's Sir's brother. You know the dude, oh, Sir. Shit, Greg gonna kill me. Sue Sue Surf. Huh? Sue Surf the TSU. No, Sir the the R and B artist. Oh, I, I, brother. <laughs> We looking yeah. crazy right now. I thought you meant. I know you mean sir. I thought you meant surf, like as the no, battle no, rapper. No, 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 no. Okay, got it. Okay, cool. It's all good. It's all yeah. good. It's all good. Yeah, but, I, don't, um, I don't know, but okay. The dude's really good. He's he's um he's not signed with TDE, but sir, the R and B dude is signed with TDE. I know, and he does song with he does songs with Kendrick. Oh, okay, but okay. they trying to say he's like the new lyrical coming from the West. He's dope, but nah, nah. You, he, ain't, re- you ain't ready yet. Not for Kendrick. Okay. Not for Kendrick. Okay. But um. Back to the J. Cole songs. They were amazing. And um, if J. Cole, if if you were to possibly see this, man, we need you in this game. I, I put up a post the other day, and I was saying we need J. Cole. And I seen a, I got a few people who told me their thoughts on it and everything. And, um, I mean, going, growing up with Cole and seeing, like, the lights, please, and different records like that, we need you, man. You make great music, and um, I know you said this might be your last project, and I know a lot of rappers lie about that shit, so I hope this is a lie. I definitely hope this is a lie, because we, we need Cole. It very well could be, because Jay-Z retired like 50 million times. Big facts. <laughs> and came back. Big facts. So, yeah. um, yeah, we definitely need Cole, man. Lil Wayne said he retired and came back, too. That's true. Yeah. That's true. So, there is hope. There is hope. Yeah, I mean, true. Logic could stay, but... Who? He, <laughs> Wait, who you just said? Logic. No, nah, he could go. Yeah, he could. He could. I mean, I'm no, like not logic stay, is music. Not stay. I mean, like stay, go, like oh. go and stay, like go and stay. Permanent retirement. <laughs> I mean, you heard his new project? 
Not yet. No. Yeah. I'll 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 make sure to get to it. But <laughs> the intro was cool, but I turned it off in the second try. So it wasn't that <laughs> engaging. I mean, I'm hearing a lot this of people. Was, I'm hearing on Facebook. I'm hearing on Facebook. Oh, that Logic album was cool. I just like don't kill us. It probably is. But um, I immediately put it back on that currency. Yeah. Yeah. No. 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 <laughs> I didn't. I didn't um, I have it's a couple of songs I like from Logic, but I haven't um I haven't really got to that yet. Shouts out the Logic though. We we not gonna we not gonna mm-hmm. disrespect that man. I I respect it. I respect it. Yeah. But um, 